breaking my limits. This ends here. Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Massblade here. Okay, so um, I know I haven't done one of these videos in quite a while um, because, you know, Christmas and all this stuff just going around. Okay, it's been crazy. Okay, but I actually um, bought quite a lot of stuff for myself, you know, I mean, but that, that doesn't really matter anymore. Okay, so anyway, so I hope you guys um, enjoyed your Christmas. I hope you guys, like, had a good one, you know. I hope 2017 is going to be a good year, okay? I, I really hope so. Because, well, I know there's a lot of stuff that's going to drop in 2017. Like, a lot of good movies, animes, um, freaking MMOs. Well, not even just MMOs, you know, really good games like on PS4 and stuff. You know, there's going to be a, a shit ton of stuff to look forward to. But, yeah. I hope um, this all goes well. But, anyway. So. Twilight Spirits, okay, I want to thank um, my friend Adrian for sending this to me on my Skype, um, really cool guy, you know, I actually didn't even see this game, you know, I actually didn't even know this game existed, to be honest, but it is a Chinese MMO, okay, so it caught my attention, alright, Twilight Spirits Online, it's pretty damn good from what I've seen, especially the combat, the combat guys is really good. Okay, but I don't know. You know, it's it's really different from um, Revelation Online for sure. But yeah, it is a China um, MMO, so you can't really expect um, too much. But yeah, so anyway, um, this game is actually um, published by NetEase. I don't really know too much, but yeah, we're just um, here to check out the game. Really, I'm not really gonna go too in-depth guys okay i don't really want to go like overboard but you know okay so twilight spirits um there's the blade master the sword mage the um the assassin the i think oh the gunslinger and um there's a, a fist fighting type class as well but I, I don't know the actual name i apologize guys but you know it, it is what it is but I mean, the combat is really nice, I have to say for sure. Okay, the combat looks really damn good. Um, so, their first closed beta began on August the 26th. But, you know, I mean, I think it's on like their third closed beta stage now. So yeah, it's, it's been it's been a while. I mean, we're, we're in 2017 now, so, I mean. That's, uh, that's that's bound to happen, but yeah, they're in probably like CBT3 right now. But the gameplay, guys, it looks pretty damn nice, okay? I know for sure. There is going to be a lot of damn good MMOs coming this year for 2017, guys. I, I am so hyped, okay? I will play a few of them, but I don't know what to expect, okay? I, I don't know, okay? We'll see. We will see, okay? But anyway, um, by the way, I actually got a new mic. I don't know if you guys can hear the difference but I don't know it, it sounds it sounds all right but yeah okay so um blade master is the class for sure that I will pick on this game I mean you guys already know I like a sword fighting class you know especially if it's a great sword if it's a great sword I am all about that life okay you guys already know all right your boy loves the great swords all right mass blade up in here Alright, but um, Blade Master is the class on this game that I would pick because there is not a great sword wielding class on this game, so yeah. I mean, on Revelation Online, you actually have a great sword, but on this game, it's just one katana, you know. But I gotta say, guys, the Blade Master on this game it looks pretty damn dope. Okay, I've seen the skills and the combat; it looks really nice. It reminds. <laughs> okay. There are there is so many friends that have been telling me the Blade Master on this game it looks like fucking Virgil from Devil May Cry. I know, I know, guys. Okay, I know. Stop telling me. All right, I know. Okay, it does. It really does. But yeah, you know. <laughs> I mean, it's it's pretty cool. Okay, but damn. Um, I don't know if I'll actually play this game though. But you know. Um, so, yeah, it is a Chinese MMO, so it will have some features that are kind of similar to Blade and Soul or 
or Revelation Online, you know, it has like that that Chinese kind of look. So, I mean, that's that's expected anyway. But I mean, I like I like these type of MMOs. You guys already know I actually prefer Eastern MMOs rather than the Western ones because they just give you so much more action-packed combat. You know, it's so good. I like it. You know, I like the design better as well. Well, some of them, some of them, I've got to say, but I do prefer some of the Western designs. But you know. But overall, like the gameplay wise, I do prefer um, Eastern MMOs, especially like the PvP. The PvP is really nice. This game's PvP as well. Um, I checked out the arena PvP. It looks pretty damn good. Um, the combat is it's really well, really well structured. It, look, it looks pretty good. Um, I noticed you can like do combos and stuff. That that was pretty hype. Okay, I'm never gonna lie. That's pretty cool. Um, so there's like 60 dungeons. 60 dungeons in this game. There, there's a lot of dungeons, guys. It's mainly um, a PvE-based game. This one, okay. It's mainly a PvE type of MMO. If you like, if you really like PvE, then this game you're really gonna enjoy it. Okay, I gotta say, the, there's a lot of PvE um, features you can do in this game. But yeah, I mean the PvP is pretty cool too. So I mean it's still giving you um, a large variety of stuff you can do. But yeah, um, I didn't actually, well, I didn't dig too deep in this game, but you know, I mean, I, I just like checked it out and stuff. I just, I'm just like telling you guys stuff just fresh off the bat, you know, I didn't, I didn't really like do like a full ton of research, but you know, um, I just wanted to show this game to you guys if you haven't seen it. It looks pretty dope. Okay, but one thing that, um, one thing that caught me was the character creation. Okay, now this I didn't really understand. Like, I don't know, it's like every class has to stay in its default appearance. You can't really like change the look to suit your own personal liking. You know, it's um, it just has to stay default, you know? Like for the Blade Master, you have to have like the black with the, the ponytail black hair. It has to stay the same, you know. All the classes, all of them, it has to stay the same. But like the gunslinger, um, he wears like this helmet, and like, you see like this this blue this light blue ponytail like just sticking out at the back. But yeah, that's that's how it has to be, you know. You have to keep the same look. I I, I don't really like that. They they might change that. I, I don't know, but if they do, that would be pretty cool. I mean, I hope they do change that because. I know there's a lot of players that would love to customize their character to, um, to their liking, you know, because I think that's that's pretty annoying, you know, how you can't change the look. But yeah. Um so yeah, it's also gender locked as well. It's it's fixed gender, so if you pick um the blade master you have to be a male. If you pick the uh, sword mage you have to be a female. It's, it's, it's gender locked, so Anyway, um, arena PvP. You can also do guild versus guild as well and stuff. It's pretty cool. I mean, the combat, guys. Like I said before, the combat is really nice. Okay, that is like the biggest. That's like the best bit about this game. Okay, the combat. The combat is really cool. But anyway, okay. So that's about all I wanted to show you guys. Um, tell me what you think. You know, in the in the comments below or send it to me on Facebook, Skype, whatever. You know, I'll, I'll um, post it on the Facebook chat anyway, so you guys can check it out. But yeah. Alright. That's, um, that's about it. So, anyway. Thank you guys for watching. Again, this is Billy Boy Massplayed here, and I will see you guys next time.
限界を超える Breaking my limits. Clear! 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 Clear!